Hi, I'm Mike Massimino. I'm Don Pettit. And welcome to the Inside ISS Mailbag. Mailbag. This okay, what is your favorite, most important experiment being conducted on ISS? Okay, I think by far the most significant experiments on ISS are those that we do to ourselves to learn about human physiology because being in a weightless environment is something we can't do on Earth mm -hmm. and it provides a physiological challenge unlike anything on Earth and it's a new knob in which to see how experimental physiology works. Right. And it can help uh, with things like osteoporosis. And yeah. yeah, that and, and other, eyeballs uh, yeah, because well, we're finding right. people from space station, about 70% of people that go to space station now come back with with measurable eye retinal maladies and so it's like what's going on here we mm -hmm. haven't a clue we're trying to figure it out and another area is material science yes you know, with all the yeah because they can mix yeah. materials different because you don't have the gravity getting in the way and you're able to answer a lot of questions in that area to come up with better materials for designing all kinds of uh, all kinds of products that help us on earth is aspirin or any other kind of medication allowed on ISS oh, yeah oh yeah we got this huge mega a medical kit it's almost like a little pharmacy and, right. and, and, and you, you got to think about it, you've got six people up there uh, living away uh, from uh, real medical care for a long period of time. We have all kinds of stuff. We, we've got catheters, we've got chest tubes, we've got needles this long, we've got all kinds of, of medical drugs that, that we are either trained to use or we use them in conjunction with a medical flight surgeon on the ground uh, if we have that kind of medical emergency. Yeah, and you, and you test all that stuff. Make sure you're, you, first of all, if it's equipment, you know want to know how to work it. Yes. But also the different, if you, a lot of the stuff you might not have taken, so you want to make sure that you're okay with the different antibiotic or whatever. For aspirin, though, I remember taking aspirin on spacewalking days to thin our blood out a little bit make us less susceptible to bends. Does that make sense, Don? Do you remember uh, doing that? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You take an aspirin, yeah, you, take an aspirin uh, yeah. uh, you take one aspirin before you get in your spacesuit. Right. Yeah, that's so standard protocol. for sure, and lots of other stuff as well. What's your plans for when you get home? I assume that Today? means from, yeah, well, let's <laughs> see, I got... When I get home. No, I think they like I, when you're in space and you're going to come back. Oh, uh, when, like when What's you, the first thing you wanted to do or, or that's, again, who did you want to see when you first got back? Uh, my, my family. Good answer. And then, then the next, what, then, and then that, Mike Massimino was no, right got, top of the list. So what was, so what did you want to do when you got back? What did you miss the most? Um, so, a hot shower, because remember, yeah. we're in space and, and we go for six say, months. Maybe now that would be such a bad idea for you. Yeah. <laughs> right, okay, maybe so I'll, I'll do one tonight too. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah, all right. So a hot shower. I miss pizza. Pizza. That's what I wanted. Yeah. No, no. That, I, I bet you missed that deep dish Chicago style pizza. I'm not the thin stuff from New York. <laughs> No, I miss pizza, and uh, that was about it, really. 